Good evening, everyone. It has been an eventful day. We had a little mishap here with the water heater, and um, gallons and gallons of water went pouring into the trailer. Eventually, we were able to get it fixed and get the water to go outside, but that was after tons of water was in the bottom of the trailer, which obviously it's already water damaged, but still there's a ton of water sitting under the floor. So we ripped up more of the floor, we got the shot back in here, got the water out, and I've had the fans running on it all day long. But we did get some, uh, we did make some progress today. Finally got the uh, heater out. I didn't realize that the thing holding it was actually the vents that are on the outside of the trailer, so I got them removed. There was a nice little wasp nest inside of one of the vents, but we got that out. And then we were able to pull the, uh, the heater out, and I marked everything and numbered it so I know what goes where when it goes back. Still haven't figured out this situation of how I get this out of here because the wires are not giving it all and I really don't want to unplug anything. Let's see, what else did we get done today? Got the tub out. Um, I have to say getting the tub out was probably the easiest thing I've done on this trailer besides maybe taking the stove vent out. Um, stove vent, bathtub, easiest things we've done. The only thing that hasn't given me any trouble. Um, next I have to get this uh, brace out. The only issue with this is because the flooring is rotten, a lot of these screws just they just turn they don't actually pull out because there's nothing holding them there so they don't bite um, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get that screw out and then I'm gonna pry this up and try to get it up without damaging the walls then I gotta get the support piece out and I was holding the tub up and tomorrow we're gonna get the toilet out I don't know what all that entails or how uh, gross that's gonna be but it's gonna be done and then um, 95% sure how we get this out, so I just gotta tape off these wires and mark them so I know where they go when we go back to put it together. And then we gotta figure this out, so those are the main things standing in our way, is just stuff in the bathroom, this guy, that, and still this cabinet. But. Um, I did order what I believe is all the things that I need to fix this window. I got the, uh, the tape that seals around it and I got some sealant. I also ordered replacement vents for both of these. Um, I got to looking at them and they look like they're warped. I'm assuming it's from just the way the wood is warped now. But they just they don't sit right and it's just allowing water to pour in so i did order some new ones of those they were like 30 bucks each on ebay and yeah so because of the water we had to tear up more of the floor just make sure we we're getting it all out and uh, as we got over here realized there's already like a hole in the floor so that's where i have the extension cord running 